semiconductor industry is in crisis and it has shaken the electronic industry to its core. As we are going more and more digital, millions of products like cars, televisions, mobiles depend on computer chips. Not only these devices, computer chips also power the factories that make these products. People are finding it hard to buy a new PS5 gaming console. Smartphone makers have felt the pins too. Car companies are delaying deliveries by months after COVID-19. Is chip shortage the new normal? As the world grapples with chip shortage, the auto industry bigwigs like Toyota and Nissan are expecting flat profits for this year. BMW is shipping some of its new cars without Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. Ford has reportedly shipped some of its explorers without functionality for rear car seat controls that operate heating, ventilation, and air conditioning, though controllable from the driver's seat. What caused the problem? Well, you guessed it, COVID-19. Auto industry which is most hit by chip shortage and other electronics manufacturers cancelled semiconductors orders in the midst of COVID-19 which took supply chains a while to adjust. On the contrary, due to lockdowns, people started doing everything from home. They upgraded their computers, bought smart speakers, new gaming consoles, televisions, mobiles, etc, etc. Businesses rushed to set up remote work systems, streaming services saw 71% increase in viewership, giving rise to cloud infrastructures. All of this created massive hike in demand for semiconductors. Global sales of semiconductors touched a record $556 billion in 2021, up more than 26% year over year according to the Semiconductor Industry Association. On top of that, shipping costs saw a tenfold increase because of the sudden rise in demand. Compounding the problem is the complex manufacturing process of chips. The average chip has a front-end production cycle of up to 24 weeks. Further, it takes up to 8 weeks on the back-end to package and test it before the finished chip is finally shipped to the customer. With global chip shortage entering its second year, Intel's CEO expects supply shortages until 2024. Hope this has been informative to you. Please like the video, share and subscribe the channel.